Hello and greetings from semi-rural Surrey in England. It's been a little while, so I thought it was high time I made a couple of videos to demo a few of the bases that have come into my possession over the last few months. And today, for your delectation, I have an Ibanez EHB1265NM. The NM referring to the natural mocha top, which is a sort of satin finish walnut top, very nicely figured too on a chambered ash body with a nine piece panga panga and walnut neck and a panga panga fingerboard and as you can see it's multi-scale going from 35 inch scale on the b string up to 33 inch scale on the g the idea being that it offers a more consistent tension across all strings on the fingerboard which certainly seems to be the case also the 35 inch scale b benefits from the clarity and uh, tonal consistency uh, making it an integral part of the bass. We've all played basses over the years where the, the, the G and the D and A and E are fine and then the B's horribly flabby like an elastic band almost like an afterthought stuck on the uh, standard four string bass. Not so with this bass. Very nice instrument. Um, now as far as the pickups are concerned it comes fitted with Bar Bartolini Mark IIs. I've actually upgraded these to some Angolars which are a little bit brighter and crisper and got a bit more oomph to them although the Barts were nice as well. Uh, and it's got the Ibanez Very Mid preamp, controls are master volume, pickup pan with a centre detent, uh, treble and bass cut and boost on a stack knob, and mid sweep and mid cut and boost on a second stack knob, and a preamp on off. Because uh, it actually sounds very nice passive as well, this bass. So I'll we'll play a few uh, tunes and uh, see what you think of the tone, starting with the EQ flat, pickup pan in the centre. Uh, and the EQ on the mixer flat as well. Next we'll uh, put the pickup pan forward to the neck pickup, a bit more of a P bass tone. And if we pan it to the rear pickup on its own. And uh, the cat just chiming in there, apologies. <laughs> Uh, we'll try playing about with the EQ a little bit more. I put a little bit of bass boost, a little bit of treble boost on, and we're back to balanced in the middle of the two pickups. Next we'll have a little play around with the MIDI cue, so uh, I'll have to leave the mic up for this. We'll start with the the boost on full and I'll move the sweep around so you can hear the, the, the range of the sweep. So that's mid up high. <laughs> very versatile bass uh, and the, the weight and the balance is fabulous very light really well balanced and to be honest 
the fan fits look cool too, don't they? Anyway, I'll be back shortly with another video for you. Thanks for watching.